Hey, what's going on guys? Running with God976 here, and we are back with some more DBZ, the legacy of Goku number two. We left off last time getting everything, absolutely everything done in West City. Yes, there's gonna be some stuff later on in the game that we can do in West City, but for now that's all done. So don't worry about it. <laughs> this time, we're gonna get things started. But uh, yeah, I went a little haywire with Ah, uh, yeah, I went a little haywire with the, uh, with the, uh, training off screen. <laughs> oh, man. Um, so yeah, Gohan's level 24. As is Piccolo! <laughs> but look at the difference in their stats. That, this annoys me so much. Piccolo is so annoying to train. I mean, Gohan, I had to reset maybe twice overall for him. There was only one time that he got everything plus one. Other than that, everything, he was always getting at least one plus two, usually two plus twos. Piccolo, on the other hand, oh my god, it was so difficult just to get him more than plus one on just anything. His endurance is just, ugh, crap. It's crap. There's no sugarcoating it. It is crap. I do not like his endurance. I'm very tempted to use this capsule on him, but... For the time being, I'm not going to. We're just going to hold off on that. And now that I'm finally done with the grinding, we're finally done with everything we can do here. We're done with everything we can do at this general part of the game. So let's get a move on. Let's head over to where Goku's at and let's get this training started for those androids. Let's go. It's been way overdue. Come on now. Gotta take care of these. Never mind, I don't. <laughs> I was gonna say, let's take care of the snakes first, but uh, I forgot that that happened. <laughs> hey guys, did you have a good time in West City? I don't want to talk about it. Yeah, I wouldn't want to talk about Gohan running straight into you and you squinting at him either, especially to his dad, like Goku. Not like Piccolo would really care, but he, at this point, Goku easily whoops Piccolo. So, you have three years to train, Dad. I said that wrong. That's right, and we better make them count. God, it's horrible. But yes, there goes the training. They have just trained for three years. You see, Gohan looks a little different. Three years later, this is why I told y'all to keep your levels low. Don't train like halfway or anything you want to have your level all the way down and this is also why I um, brought them both to level 24 versus level 25 because I knew that they were gonna gain a level right here anyway so might have, yeah, I'm just gonna leave it at 25 trust me this is ridiculous grinding levels right here I am not supposed to be anywhere near this high like usually if I don't really do a lot of grinding I'll normally be around level 17 at this point did a lot of grinding. <laughs> and yes, they can both use different techniques now. I will get into how to do that later. For now, let's just go through the rest of this. It's about time to head to a, a Minbo Island. I still cannot find that word. And this, this is the day that Boyd predicted the androids would arrive. Master Rosie also has some new skills to teach you guys. You should have paid him a visit when you get a chance. I'm ready! Alright, let's get on the way. So yes, you can use the L button to change your attacks. So we have Masenko Ha for Go On, and also his regular Key Blast, which yeah, Key Blast. Oh, and I also I absolutely love that they changed the uh, the uh, theme, and now it's Fall in here. Oh, I love it! I love that they do that. Versus just keeping everything the same. No, where's the where's the where's the good good stuff in that? Where's the uh, quality in that? There we go. That's where I'm looking. But now, okay, let's see real quick. He was at 39, and okay, yeah. It looks like he only gained plus one on everything. I think his power is at 43, I can't remember for sure. No, his strength is at 43, his power is at... Every day he did gain one, that's annoying. They did just straight up gain one on everything. I didn't, I never noticed that before. That's kind of annoying, really. Oh well, no big deal. Alright, now that we got that, and Piccolo has a special beam cannon that- Oh, that's so awesome. 
You heard Goku. We have to go visit Master Roshi real quick. We don't have to, but you want to. Yeah, before we go over there to Menbo Island and take care of those androids, we're gonna do this. Switch characters. Wait, no, what am I doing? I gotta get Gohan's first. Now, before we go in, I wanna talk to... I just wanted to talk to them to get the text box up on the screen. Where, where's it at? Oh, there you are. Haha! <laughs> I forget. I forgot about that. Um. Yes, yes. Okay, there it is. I knew that there was a golden capsule somewhere here. I almost completely forgot about that. You know what? Just because of that, I'm gonna go all the way around the island again. Just to make sure that I don't miss anything. <laughs> Alright, I didn't miss anything. Okay, alright, let's go. So yeah, as you come in here, you want to talk to... Chiatsu. <laughs> He's dang right about that. Marin is just this... As... She looked in the room. Now that is the classic case of a blonde gone wrong. Yes, Masarosi will say this exact same thing every single time, except for the technique. The technique will be a little different for everybody. All it is, um, instead of just pressing A repeatedly, now, well, for me, Z, but now we can do that, we can charge up our attack and do that. That is extremely, extremely handy. Oh, if you know how to time it and you know how to use it, um, in correlation to your regular strikes, oh my god. This makes this game so much easier. It can make boss fights a lot easier too, but I tend not to try and use it for the boss fights, especially because uh, certain certain characters have different ones. Like, look at Pic Piccolo's real quick. His just stays in one spot, so you gotta use that as you as you uh, would see fit. <clears throat> There is, there's a certain grind spot that I will, I used before that is perfect for Piccolo in using that uh, technique right there. I'm not gonna worry about that for now. It's, it's not really a. Yeah, we don't have to worry about for that that for some time. Anyways, let's go ahead and get over here to Mimbo Island and see see about these androids. See if uh, Trunks was right about them. Hey, you're late. It took you so long, Piccolo. Sandroids are going to be arriving any minute now. Yeah, I'm sure you're the last one to be saying that somebody's late. Especially if it's Piccolo. So this is it. I suppose I'm as ready right now as I'm ever going to be. I just wish things didn't have to be this way. I hope you don't think I'm nuts for asking, but what's the deal with the baby, Bulma? Is he your son, Yamcha? He's not my kid. Well, if you think that's a shock, just wait. Wait until she tells you who the father really is. I bet it's Vegeta, isn't it? Right, Trunks? Now, who told you that, Goku? I was trying to keep it a secret. I was going to surprise you guys. Well, actually, I just thought I'd take a guess. I mean, he kind of does look like Vegeta. But you guessed his name, too. Yeah, what are the chances of that, huh? Maybe I'm psychic. Outrageous! Who would have guessed? Bulma and Vegeta! And while we're on this subject, where is Vegeta? I have no clue. I really haven't seen him around much lately. I know he was training to come here, but with the baby and all, I guess I must have lost track of him. He'll show up. He wouldn't miss a fight. It looks like we'll have to divide. divert. D the androids away from the city. There we go. Because if we don't too many innocent people, we'll get hurt. Yes, there are second uh, things to... Second text box for them. I'm not going to go through it all, though. You want to get the game yourself for free. Emulator. Easy enough. This city Trunks told me about, I didn't even know the city existed. There are a lot more people here than I thought. I left Shiasu with Master, Ro Master Roshi. Yeah, I noticed. We were just there. To be honest with you, I didn't think the little guy stood much of a chance out here. If Yamcha can't stand a chance out here, then you might might be right. Hey, Azurobi! You should come to help us fight the androids? No way! I just brought Zinzu beans from Corin! That's the last 
time I try your voice. As soon as those androids arrive, I'm out of here. If you guys want to stay and get yourselves killed, that's your own business. And then once you do that, you just walk back down a little bit to trigger this. Don't you think it's a bit strange? It's already after 10 o'clock. There isn't even a sign of these androids. I can't believe we listened to that guy. Androids. That's a good one. <laughs> Don't be so literal. It's only 10.17. I wouldn't jump the gun just yet. Sorry to disappoint you, Bulma. The androids just aren't coming. Yeah, what was that, Yamcha? Well, what was that? You guys! It's the androids! I see them! I did too. Where'd they go? I'm not sure. One second they were here, and then poof! They just vanished. I don't even sense their power levels. Well, they are androids, aren't they? So maybe we can't. That's crazy. How are we supposed to find them if we can't sense where they are? Well, if we can't sense their power levels, we just have to find them the old-fashioned way. With our eyes. Now remember, if you find the androids, don't try and take them on yourself. Wait for the others. And now for this part, you know, I came over here with Piccolo. It doesn't matter which, if you have Piccolo or Gohan, trust me. Just, just trust me. You, you don't need either of them. Sasebo, that's what this town is called. Okay. You can try talking to these people if you want. There's literally no point. They're just generic lines. There's no uh, items to pick up anywhere, so just go forward and find out that Yamcha found them! And then he got... Yep, yep, always gotta get beat up. This is Yamcha for you. Oh no! Yamcha! Krillin, listen, there's still a chance to save him. Take him back to Bulma and give him one of these Sinzu beans. Go as fast as you can. I'm on it! So these are the androids. Kinda funny looking if you ask me. Well now, I find it surprising that you should know we are androids. Of course, I find it even more surprising that you anticipi anticipated our arrival on this island. Tell me, how did you come how did you know we would come? If you're so tough, why don't you make us? Very well. Wait! There are way too many pe innocent people around here. We have to lead them away from the city. Yes, I agree. It is way too crowded here. Too many people can get in our way. I will see to it that they do not. No! You monster! I cleared the area of Ennesis in accordance with your wishes. Do you disagree with my methods? You leave these people out of this! There are no people left to leave. I can't do it. I'm sorry. There are no people left to leave out. <laughs> Very well. You may lead us to another place if you're choosing, Goku. Yeah, after the fact. What? How did you know his name was Goku? I know all of you. The Namek, Piccolo, and even you, the one named Tien. Let's get acquainted later. Follow me. <laughs> Meanwhile... Deep reaches of space. Until Kakarot came into the picture, I was the greatest Saiyan alive. Kakarot's success is like a demon in my head. How can he be a Super Saiyan when I, the prince of all Saiyans, am not? When I was a child, my father told me stories of the legendary Super Saiyan. A warrior so strong, that no one could defeat him. How can this Kakarot, this Goku as his friends call him, how can he do what I cannot? I am of the, the warrior elite! He is nothing but a lone born peasant. Why can't I obtain what Kakarot has obtained? It doesn't make any sense! I have been training so hard. I've given it all I have and more. No. No more! That's it! I don't care anymore! I don't care about being better than Kakarot! I don't care about being a Super Saiyan! I don't care about anything! Yes! I 
finally done it! I'm finally a Super Saiyan! This power... This power is unbelievable! Super Saiyan is a special form that gives you a temporary increase in power. Use the L button to select the Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan form icon. Then press the B button to activate the mode. Pressing the B button again will allow you to revert to your normal form. Super Saiyan form can only be activated when the yellow triangle on the left side of your status bar is full. Super Saiyan form lasts for a limited amount of time, so use it wisely. I have to get back to Earth. Now you can go around looking everywhere if you want. There's nothing on this asteroid. Just get back in the ship and go back to Earth. And now that we're back, those androids must be here by now. I doubt if Kakarot and the others gave them the introduction they deserve. Now before we go, we can go back in here real quick. Just because. I played this game so many times and I still do not realize when I don't need to do things that I do. <laughs> but alright. Now, the difference here. See, no matter what you do, no matter how much you grind. See, they're all the way at level 25. You would think that that would affect Vegeta. Oh, and that, yeah, that confirms that I'm going to use the Endurance Capsule on Piccolo. These are... I'm sorry, I, I had to freeze there for a second. These are actually extremely good stats for Vegeta. He doesn't normally have stats like this. This is weird. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of weirded out right now. Like, this... He is ridiculously good right now that is super surprising his power is normally super low and his strength and endurance are pretty high but <laughs> I'll take it I will take it yeah and that, that does confirm I'm gonna use that endurance capsule on uh, but the strength capsules we'll go ahead and use them on Vegeta it's cuz he's lower level and we're gonna get him up a little faster all right Let's see what you got to say, buddy. After the Namics left here for new Namics, several of them were left behind. If you happen to meet any Namics in your travels, please tell them to come back here. We're organizing a trip to new Namic so they can be reunited with their families. So that's another one of the uh, side quests that you can do. You got uh, find 25 golden capsules for Dr. Briefs and find the seven missing Namics and return to Capsule Corporation. We're gonna do both of those, don't worry. But obviously we can't quite do that yet, so yeah. Before we go over to uh, meet up with the androids and the rest of the guys, we're gonna go over to Master Roshi's. Every, every character that you can use, all of them have uh, a technique that they can learn from Master Roshi, so why not? We're gonna go ahead and grab it real quick. Excuse me. <laughs> you know, it's been a while since I've been up here. Let's see what's up top. Do you have anything that... Nope. Aww. I wanted to see a little bit of... Aww. 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 I forgot that they don't have funny little excerpts on those items. <laughs> but alright. Now we got that done. Let's go ahead and head over there to where the other guys are at. And uh show them how show them a thing or two about beating up these androids, huh? We're Vegeta, we gotta be a little cocky, right? Over to the southern continent. Now you walk right here. Cutscene! This is far enough. We will fight here. Before we get this show started, I want to know how you knew our names. <coughs> yes, of course. As you wish. You have been under close observation for some time by a highly sophisticated remote tracking device. This device was calibrated to own in on your, your very distinct energy pattern, and was planted on you during the World Martial Arts Tournament when you were still a boy. From that day forward, your every move was monitored, your fighting techniques were studied, and the secrets of your Kamehameha wave were revealed. 
It was studied until Dr. Jiro had it gathered enough information to create the perfect fighting machines. Powerful machines. Fully capable of destroying you. The way you destroyed Dr. Jiro's red ribbon. I'm curious. <laughs> was he spying on me while I was fighting on Planet Nanak? There was no need. By that time, Dr. Jiro had compiled all the necessary information concerning your skills. But I think you know everything about me. But really, you're not even close. Did your calculations predict that Goku would become a Super Saiyan? Super Saiyan? This is the most unexpected development indeed! This technique is not listed in my files, 20. Nor am I. But my sensors indicate that there is no cause for concern. Yes! Is a most impressive ability, but nothing we cannot handle. 19 will demonstrate this by himself. Alright, I think you're away. But I wouldn't bank on it if I were you. Uh, what's up with the coughing from Goku? It's gotta be a little worrying. Now, yeah, this right here can be a little bit annoying to deal with. Bombs. Is that still not down? Wow. Jeez. That uh <laughs> yeah. I I don't really like fighting those guys right there just because they take forever to get all of them and when they gang up on you. Ooh. But yeah, you wanna go to the left first, um, so that you can grab that golden capsule. Real quick, I just want to check to see what that puts us at golden capsule wise. Nine. Alright, that's good. Alright, let's go ahead. Yes, these guys again. Alright, there we go. It's not so bad when you uh, come out come out one of the sides to attack them, but when you're very first getting here, yeah, yeah, it can be annoying. See? Haha! <laughs> Their techniques, yeah, they really can be quite useful. Keep that in mind. Oh, it's really good to mix your attacks up like that. There we go, level 19. <sighs> not a great level, but I'll take it. It's not too shabby. With, with his endurance being up as it is, I'm not too worried about his um, levels. Vegeta tends to get decent levels. Uh, whereas, you know, Piccolo obviously does not. There we go, nice. Two crits. I like when I get crits in a row like that. It's always fun. Uh, you can go down here if you want, you don't need to, um, this is just a save point, which, yes, this is gonna be our main hub right now. You can try and switch characters, you can't do it right now, because they're preoccupied with something else, so we're gonna have to use Vegeta at the moment, which is fine with me, because, you know, I want, I, I got a lot of grinding to do with Vegeta, so I'm gonna be using Vegeta primarily for some time. <laughs> Alright, now we gotta take care of these little buddies, get them out of the way. So that we can open up this gate right here. Which honestly, there's no need for me to do this quite yet, because I'm not even gonna go that way yet. But eh, whatever. Oh, there must be one more. There you are. Yeah. I, I think if you don't actually go up there quite yet, that it'll uh, come back up and you'll have to defeat one more again to be able to go that way. But no big deal. For now, let's just go over here. We're gonna try and get all the items that we can at this point. Alright, don't want to be bombed then. Blast it. There we go. Alright, here we go. You're not gonna bomb me, but I'm not falling for that anymore. I'm apparently falling for not being able to punch a stationary rock, though. Alright, we're back over here, so that means that we've gotten everything that we can do so far over here. Wow, I guess I want to grab that. There we go. Alright. And we're about to gain another level. Good stuff. One more guy and we got another level.
Whoa, buddy. Level 20. Oh, come on! I can't stand getting those levels, man. But alright, let's go ahead and go up here. We're just gonna go the same way that we were earlier. And see if we don't have to beat another one. Okay, no, it's still open. That's good. Alright. So I'm not going to go all the way to where um, Goku and them are at. I'm just going to go show y'all all of the uh, regular terrain first, and then... Oh, I get these guys, man. They're so annoying. And then uh, I'm going to go back and save. We'll save, we'll save the, uh, the big fight for the next episode. Don't worry. Don't worry. We'll still do it get there eventually just in time <laughs> all right let me go this way I believe there is a capsule up here some kind of capsule oh, I can't remember all right enough of the punchies I don't like that game golden capsule that's right all right so that's there I'm gonna head back up and head back to that save point and I think that will be it for today see if we can't get another level before we get over there. That'd be nice. Oh, but no. Not happening, buddy. Yeah, not happening, buddy. I'm not your buddy, guy. I'm not your guy, friend. <laughs> get, get used to that. I'm gonna do that literally almost every time that I say buddy, guy, or friend. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright. We just need a couple more and then we're getting a level. And then I will be back over there at the save point. Something like that. Go this way so we can face the other ones. No! You're not supposed to hit me! Ah! Another you! Alright, come on guys. Let's get this show on the road. Oh, I'm gonna have to fight two more, so... Let's do this guy. One more. That should do it. Please give me a good level this time, baby. Why do I do that? Yeah, I will take it. Anytime I get two endurance, I like it. Power is... Yeah, power is cool and all, but that's my least needed uh, stat, I guess. I don't know. Not too bad. He's only getting three levels so far, but he's still four levels behind. And his stats are almost comparable to uh, Piccolo's. Strength's only three below. His power, obviously, way, way below. But yeah, no big deal there. No shame in that. But all right, guys, that is going to be it for today. I've got a lot of stuff I need to do out in the real world. Uh, yeah, I got my. I'm starting my new best job in uh, two days. I gotta go get some uh, materials for it, uh, gas and all that stuff. Or uh, tired my tired yeah my anyways i hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching if you liked leave a like if you liked it a little more maybe share it that'd be nice <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching next time we will pick things up and we will head over there and see about what uh if we can help out goku with that fight god bless you guys and i'll see y'all then